What is up guys, Yuzne here, and um, this will be a tutorial over Handbrake. Uh, it was very much requested, and what Handbrake does is, um, I'll show you guys where the download link is in a second, but what it does is um, it takes uh, your video file, let's say you render it straight out of After Effects, like what I just did with these two, and uh, it seems like After Effects makes the biggest file ever. And what Handbrake will do is it'll compress the file and make it a lot smaller. So let's take this for example. I rendered a little bit out of my Dare tournament entry. It's not really an entry. I'm not really, I'm not really gonna enter. It's just like a little edit for myself and for your enjoyment. So let's get the info. Uh, 66 megabytes. It's not that long. Uh, it is actually it is seven seconds long. And uh, if we go to the one that Handbrake made, 8 megabytes, which is a ton better. And also some benefits are, if we play this video file real quick. And no, that wasn't the YouTube lag. It just lags. It stays on a frame. And because the, um, uh, I don't know what I used to play it because I didn't use QuickTime. Uh, if, you, if you're on a Mac, you can click and play. Uh, press on your space bar and it'll play, but uh, it can't re like can't like uh, get the information from the video fast enough to show you. But when you compress it, I got it it's a lot faster. So um, yeah, and yeah, that's some a little preview of uh, part of the latest edit that I'm doing. I think it's gonna be pretty cool. Uh, I didn't add all the effects yet, but I think the CC looks pretty nice. I must click that. So let's get into the actual tutorial. Open up Handbrake and then click Source. If it doesn't open up that already, then you're going to want to look at the file, like daretermin.mp4. Just click Open. And then if this is an MP4, just change it to MV4. There is no di uh, M4V. There is no difference. Uh, all it does is just change the name so you don't get rid of this file because if you do um, it might create problems like if handbrake messes up compressing it and stops and then you don't you don't have to render in after effects again that will suck so uh, what I do here uh, I keep it at constant quality frame rate I don't do same as source it depends actually in after effects if you don't render 29.97 sometimes when you render uh, it in 29.97 it messes up the sync so uh, I render sometimes in 59.94 but if you don't if you render in 59.94 click 29.97 because uh, YouTube will downgrade it uh, mine's already 29.97 so it doesn't matter YouTube will downgrade it to 29.97 anyway so it'll make it a faster upload time and that's pretty much it you just click start uh, I'll overwrite mine and it starts and it will take no time at all because mine is a, a not a very large file to compress but if you have like a three minute montage then it'll take it'll take a while like 10 minutes maybe maybe a little more but that was a really simple tutorial um i hope you guys enjoyed it uh i also have a few things to say i am partnered now so uh yeah it took a while but i'm there so thank you all for that. Now, just because I'm partner doesn't mean that you, all you guys get to go be inactive now. Um, the more active you are, the more I can interact with you guys. I'll start hosting uh, editing competitions. Also, if you have any tutorials that you want to upload onto my channel, you can uh, send me the file or send me the video link uh, via PM. And I will look at it and see if uh, I want to upload it or not. And it can be anything I've done, so that narrows it down to a few things. I mean, I've covered a lot of basic stuff. So, yeah, those are the last two things I wanted to say. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and I uh, hope you guys stay active. So, yeah, peace out. Yeah.